I'm Dr. Stanley Lam. I'm a skeletal physician in Hong Kong. During the following few minutes, you are going to see prolotherapy to be done in various regions of our body. It can be neck, back, shoulder, elbow, hips, etc. Prolotherapy is a safe and non-invasive procedure comparing to surgery. The, the principle of prolotherapy is simple. It is by injecting growth factor production stimulant that stimulate the growth factor release or a growth factor itself. Growth factor production stimulant can be hypertonic glucose or growth factor itself it can be in the form of adjoining your blood and use of centrifuge machine to produce the platelet-rich plasma. We inject either of these solutions to the point of injury, to the soft tissue injury, which include ligaments that joins the bones together, the tendons insertion that joins the muscle to the bone, it can be the joint capsule, it can be the cartilage inside our joint. If these soft tissue are easily injured and they produce pain, usually in the form of chronic pain, and they are very difficult to heal because they have poor blood supply. By injecting this growth factor production stimulant or growth factor, they pro we produce a localized self-limited inflammation in the region of uh, in this soft tissue in the region of injury and um, that has done the healing process and treat the root cause of the pain if you have any problem about prolotherapy you can contact musculoskeletal physician or visit our website www.hkimm.hk Hi, I'm Dr. Stanley Lab. Today I'm going to do um, right shoulder prolotherapy. And uh, I've done the skin um, cleaning with the betadine and also the alcohol. And right now, and also these skin markings are corresponding to to my injection site. Okay. Uh, I'm right now giving some local anesthetics. This uh, no king. in the skin blabbing. This, this is a long hand bicep. And this is a greater tuberosity with the attachment of the supraspinators. And uh, this point corresponds to the later on as change the position of um, the shoulder and then to do all the things okay after doing the skin blabbing and um, switching to a longer needle here this is the awkward process you saw right a little but actually it's not that pain not that Oops. painful Okay, and then after injecting the coracle process, um, I'm targeting uh, this as uh, the coracle curricular ligament here, pointing towards the, the lateral third, another third, the tip of the clavicle, another coracle clavicular ligament, and I'm um, pointing towards the chromium. This is the crocodile chromium oh, yeah. ligament. Oh, yeah. You have yes. some pain, right? Some pain is like four. Four or out of ten. ten. Yeah. That's bearable, right? Yeah. Okay. And then this is um. Okay, this is the bicipital groove. And oh, yeah. this is the long head of bicep here. This is the groove. Okay, all the way down. This is the groove. Okay, so and then externally rotate the hand that uh, bring out the the subscapularis attachment, the lesser tuberosity. Okay, and then I have to switch the very much longer needle. Yes, and this uh. 
that is um, for the inferior capsule anterior inferior capsule and ligament okay this is the humeral he head okay this is the space joint space and uh, middle to that that is the this is the establum the okay, labor so so right yeah so how's how, how you grading not not pain but very sore very sore okay. yeah still very sore right yes okay this is the all the labor rotating a little bit that mm. brings the shoulder forward okay and then can you put the hand behind your, your buttock yes okay that brings the internal rotator shoulder and right now this is the greater velocity with uh, this is the attachment of the supraspinatus okay in fact it's a quite a broad uh, tendon okay can you put the sh uh, this hand over the left shoulder okay that brings the infraspinatus here uh, it's a pain and very sore very sore right oh uh, yeah okay and this is the teres minor how do you feel? Uh, very very sore very very sore okay and also some of the fibers attaching to the okay the posterior joint capsule okay and uh, we have done this uh, intraarticular injection and then we can go from behind and then from uh, the front okay it's done